I want you to give it up for my friend, Brad Bellinger. Yeah, get up here, Brad. I'm from upstate New York. Yeah. No, don't, don't. It doesn't deserve that. Come on. That's upstate, really. It's like saying I'm from Canada. You wouldn't applause that shit. Being from upstate sucks, you know, because when you tell people who aren't from New York that you're from New York, they're like, oh my god, the Big Apple. And I'm like, well, there were apples there. <laughs> Big apple, small apples, not that apple, you know? But right now I'm living in a crack house in Queens. Yeah, now that you can give an applause for, yeah. yeah. It's not a crack house because it has the similarities of a crack house. It's a crack house because somebody spray painted on the garage door, this is a crack house. <laughs> and that person was me, and then I moved out. I did. New York is uh, it's teaching me a lot of things. It's teaching me to save money. The other day I was on the subway, and I found an iPhone. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Her Facebook was saved on her iPhone. Her Facebook status was, I just got home, realized I forgot my iPhone on the subway. But don't you worry, I'll get it back. Very condescending. Don't you worry, I'll get it back. I left a comment. No, you won't. I kept it. I kept her phone. It's in my pocket, recording my set at the cellar. It's going great. Yeah. New phone. You gotta save money, you know? You gotta save money. I, uh, I have two parents. They split up. Any divorced children here? I don't know if that makes sense. Divorced children. Did you get married as a child and get divorced? I don't know. I have a half-brother. Yeah. My mom had two different children with two different dads. Yeah. My dad, my brother was like, we should get a tattoo that says same portal, different spit. I didn't get that tattoo. Didn't think that was a good idea. He did though, he got it. On his ass. Yeah, that didn't happen actually, I just made that up. I made that joke up. Because that's why I'm here. And that's why you're there. Yeah. No, uh, it's weird, you know, growing up uh, with a parent who has lots of pets, right? Any dog lovers here? Dog lovers? Yeah? My dad was weird, right? Because we would have a lot of dogs growing up. When they died, he'd buy a dog that looks just like that old dog and name it the same thing. Yeah. I know, right? Strange. But I was, like, used to it. Until a year later, after I graduated, I came home, he has another son named Brad. Yeah. And his name's not even Brad, he just calls it that. It, that, yeah. I just got a long distance relationship. I did, yeah. I got out of it unscathed, no AIDS. She's not pregnant. I win, is the way I look at it, yeah. The thing is, is the reason she broke up with me is because she needed space. She lives in Florida. I'm in New York. Any more space, you're in Cuba. I'm in the fucking, yeah. Canada. I'm back upstate. That's where I am. I'm back, I'm back where I belong. Yeah. No, it's made me think differently about women. Like every time I, th every time I see a movie, no matter what the girl's character is, right away I think, bitch. <laughs> I don't know why. It's this, it's not her fault. It's her fault. It's her fault. You know. Like the other day, Titanic was on, and I thought, Rose, heartless bitch. Right at the end of the movie, when she's on the door, there was definitely room for Jack on the door. Right? If I was Jack, I'd be like, Rose, move your fat ass over. Getting hypothermia. What gets me? She's like, I'll never let go. Jack must have woke up halfway through, like, what the hell? I was just sleeping. Blow the whistle. Adam and Eve. Anybody, you know, Adam and Eve, if you believe in that, they're the first male and female on earth. If you believe in that, you're an idiot. But if you do believe in that, they were given clear instructions. You can do anything you want, just don't eat an apple. Adam got that right away. He's like, I'll hang out, jack off, hang out with squirrels. I like grapes anyway. <laughs> Eve was like, I'm gonna eat that fucking apple. <laughs> what convinced her to do it? A snake. What's a snake shaped like people? A dick, a talking dick. <laughs> Eve was a slut, that's what I'm trying to say. Eve, total slut. She ruined it for me. She ruined it. You know? Yeah, damn, that's right. It's her fault. I could go gay, but that's a lot of pain. That's a lot of pain. Yeah. 
you know, on both ends. Well, one end really, just one, one end. Apps, somebody was talking about apps earlier. Snapchat, right? Snapchat, everybody's got Snapchat here, huh? They should just call that dick pics, right? Dick pics. Just pictures of strangers' dicks, and then they disappear. They disappear. And we have Vine, you know this app Vine, right? People are getting famous overnight on these six second videos that are on a loop. They just repeat themselves. I, I don't like it because there's these blonde bimbos and they're like, I'm going to show the world just who I am in six seconds. And they got their phones and they're like, hey, this is my cat. Meow. That's my fucking cat. Ha. Hey, this is my cat. Meow. That's my fucking cat. Ha. Hey, this is my cat. Meow. That's my fucking cat. <laughs> what if that vine was in China? It'd be a whole different vine, right? We're like, hey, check out my cat. Meow. Yum. <laughs> if you're offended by that joke, I'm sorry, but I did my research. I googled, do Chinese people eat cats? All I typed in was, do Chinese? First suggestion was, eat cats. <laughs> I'm Brad Ballinger. Thank you very much. Give up your hosts.